So we're out here today in Hatteras, North Carolina. We're on the tie line. We got Michael from tie line. We got Austin from Nail. And we're catching dogfish. That's right, dogfish. We've heard they're really good eating. Don't normally target these things, but we want to try eating them. We're hungry tonight. I mean, we don't got much meat left, right? It's been this, this famine around going around here, right? <laughs> Running low. Running <laughs> low. So we're, we're hungry for dogs, and we're going to eat some dogs tonight. Here we go, 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 here we go. We got a fish, boys. Stick them, ready? Three, two, and... Yeah, we got him. Hey. Yes, yeah, <laughs> sir. Oh, it's a dog. Oh, hey, there he is. There he is, man. Look at the dog. Wow. That is, I've never caught one of those before. Wow. Get him in. <laughs> yes. There he is. Dogfish. The species of shark, guys. That's I'll the probably. dogfish. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that giant eyeball. Look at that thing. You can just tell he can see a lot up down there. Get him. Get him, Austin. Get him, Austin. Yes, I'm yes, on. he's on. He's on. <laughs> Left-handed. Bro, that is amazing. Look at the size of this dog. It's a little one, heavy one. But they're here. The spines on this one, they call them spiny dogs. There's one Oh, oh dang. Yep. There's also one on this dorsal right there, a little small. <laughs> so the way that I found out what a spiny dogfish was, well, I was catching one on a charter, and I was unhooking it, and I just put it right on my chest like this. Mm -hmm. And it got gotcha. pretty good. Well, I mean, right in the stern. I'm like, oh, and there's a spine there. It, yeah. it didn't feel very good, but. That's why they call it spotty dogs. Either of you guys, you know, said there were doggies out here right now. There we go. I'm sorry. Oh, 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 we're on. Oh, we're on. Get him, get him. Oh, that's, 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 oh, that's the meat, bro. That's a good one. That's a good one, dude. Yes, the get him, circle get hooks, him. dude, just bend the rod over so easy. I got a good one here. That's a good one. Oh, he's big, oh, that's dude. That's a good one. <laughs> get that thing in big the boat, doggy. bro. That's, that's meat right there, dude. <laughs> oh, man, that's a, that's a stud. In the boat. That's a nice one, Austin. Oh. Look at that thing. That's a, one of the bigger ones. Look at that dorsal, or the, the back spine thingy on that. You don't want to get spined by that. What's right? crazy is look at the, the front one comparative to the back one. I think he lost his front one, dude. Maybe. Here's the rig we got for this. We got an extra heavy circle hook. which is taking this fillet of a uh, mullet. Just putting this on here like that. Got him? Come on, Sam, get him. You got him? Nice. You got a bite, Austin. You got a bite. You got a bite. The doggies are here. I think, I think Dutton was us up. Got him. There he is. That's another good one. A good one. A little yeah. bit bigger. Get him in the box. He just spit up everything right there. I mean, he's been down there eating everything. Look, he spit up. Yep. You see that? Yep. He just spit up one of our tails, dude, from earlier. Yep. Look at that. Okay, so look at the uh, tail or the barbs on him. They do get smaller according to what size they are. Look at that. Yeah. A little yeah, smaller, both of them. That one there. actually, the last one I grabbed, I forgot about it. Straight me. What's on Dude, he tail? was down there just eating everything. He's been down there. He, when he came in the boat, he spit up like a whole bunch of bait. We just threw back in the water, tails and all kinds of random stuff like that. So he's been back there for a while. Kobe's do the same thing. Sit back there in your chump so you can just eat rage. everything. I got a bite. I got a bite. I got a bite. I got a bite. I think, I think we got him. I think we got him. It's pouring rain, guys. We got to put our big, our big camera away. It's going to get ruined. Here we go. Still got an iPhone. That's all that matters. And. Yeah, we got him. Yes, sir. Oh, it's a giant. Oh, yeah. Well, you didn't get off that time, did you? Oh, you did not. That's a big one, dude. Wow. We just saw our first lightning bolt, and it was not that far away, so it's time to quit fishing. Lightning, you don't play lightning, so it's time to head in. We're going to prepare these fish, fillet them, clean them up. And then we'll, uh, I think we're gonna deep fry them. We're gonna try deep fry them. But right now, we're gonna pack up and get going. We're here in the kitchen. Normally, we would fillet these fish outside, but it's pouring rain, hurricane, I don't know what name it is now. It's like, just Kobe season. It's hurricane miserable up there, okay? That's what it is. <laughs> Kobe season, <laughs> That's how it traditional happens. weather, right? <laughs> we're eating a dog fish, okay? That's what we wanna do. And Austin is so excited. I was like, here we go, ready? I was supposed to see how you clean the thing, man. Look at that meat, dude. No way. Oh, it's the whitest meat you've ever seen, I promise. No, you just sit around the like that. Let's do it like that. Don't mind the towel, folks. Look at that. Look how white that meat is, dude. It's literally the whitest meat you've ever seen. It looks like it's starting to come oh, up. so white. That's ridiculous how white that is. Hold on. This is miserable. Let's see what's left. Dude, this is that. Hey, hey, this is a great shark bait, dude. Save that. that that's, that's, a, that's a What's one bait off the beach for? That's a doggy cast bait. That's a pristine. Here, where's a bucket at? Skinning time. Ready? So far, so good. You would think a shark's gonna be so thick. It is thick. Right. Look at that. 
Now, we just gotta that's get- not a, That's not an amazing piece of meat. <laughs> that does look like an amazing piece of meat. I don't think the camera can show you how white this is. This is like ridiculously white. I, I, I don't think it's possible. There's no smell. It, it's barely there. You smell that, smell that, dude, smell that. You would think it'd be stinky, dude. No. That's unbelievable. Okay. We got the meat cleaned up. I think we're ready to bread it now and put it in some very hot grease. Predictions. I think it's gonna be pretty good. I think it's gonna be good. I just, I don't know how I feel about texture. I've never seen such white fish before, so it's kind of strange. I think I've also never amazing. eaten shark, so it's not, we'll, we'll try. you never eaten shark before? Never. Oh, dude. It looks, I mean, it, it looks tasty, but it can you be know. good. It can be very good. We'll see. We got Michael from Tideline here. He is the expert chef. I mean, pristine chef, and he's gonna show you a secret recipe here for dogfish. Pretty simple, uh, flour, cornmeal mix, egg wash, panko, really hot oil. All right, let's do it. Let's, let's see do it. it. What are your predictions? Good question, a six out of 10. Can you throw all that in there? You think yeah. six, I, I think it's gonna be better than six out of 10. Okay, here, I'm, I'm predicting 8.5 out of 10. Okay. I'm just gonna go with it, I'm gonna send it. This is our best chance for it being good. This is it, it's as fresh as it can be, it was on a good ice. Yeah, so it's just a flour dusting at a get go, and then it's a, can't go bread crumbs. Very nice. Okay, here we go. In the fryer. Eating dogfish. Never in your wildest dreams you think you were gonna eat one of these, right, Michael? I did not. Here we go. Boom. Destiny awaits. Okay, I'm saying 8.5. It look, look good coming out of panko. I'm gonna go up to a seven. You're gonna up to a seven? Yeah. Alright, what do you uh, think, Sam? Six. Six? I'm afraid of the pee taste. Like, and that's not being like you know, that it guy. But they didn't smell like it, but I've, I've smelled the sharks. And they always give out that hint. I'm like, you know oh, when you catch one on the pier, and you know when you catch one. You smell yeah, it. You know, that's what, that's what sketches me out about eating these things. But we'll try it. Those aren't done, are they? Done. Well, they're, they're done. That's done? Look how dark that is. It's cooked all the way through? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You're the tester. <laughs> I'm the tester? <laughs> this is your idea. Here we go. Ready? First taste, too. Oh, my gosh. Dude, look at how white that is. Look how white that is. Kind of scared, I'm not gonna lie. Here we go, ready? Boom. Oh yeah. Just, just, right. oh yeah. Oh yeah. Get some meat on that. That's really good. That's really good. Yeah, that's game changer right there, buddy. It's crazy. You put some honey mustard on that, and that's 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 a, that's a 9.5 out of 10. Now, I know this is pretty cliche, but that tastes just like chicken. Does it? <laughs> 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 I mean, you tell me. That's good. It doesn't taste fishy. There's no. zero fish taste. We could use, we could sure. use some lemon. Not mm -hmm. some lemon. Yeah. The flavors are so. I mean, are that's the bigger piece, Are the bigger pieces? You have the flavor. Are they done? Awesome oh, try. Yeah, they're, they're falling apart. Oh, my right my hand's falling done. apart, so. Yeah, they're done. Oh. Yep, man. Oh, oh yeah. They're, they're done. Now. Guys, like that's like raw. Like not raw, but like no no seasoning. It's just Zero raw. seasoning. It's just it's, oil. It's good. <laughs> it's it, it, it's weird. It's it weird. Is. Yeah. Like I I always catch them. I look at them like yo, what are you? And look at that. <laughs> Been letting them go all these years. <laughs> Been letting them go all these years. You ain't letting them go again. Can't. No. <laughs> They're dead. In That's the box. weird. Delicious. Great. Exceeded all expectations. Whitest meat I've ever seen in my life. And Beyond. I mean, it's you can turn it into whatever you want to. That's it's, what I was just saying. It's, it's like a, it's like blank. a perfect fish. Yeah. And you, if whatever season you want, it's gonna make it just escalate that much more. You think so? You, you think it's like a like? I mean, we we took it just from where it was, and it was okay. Then we added ketchup and yeah. hot sauce. It got better. Now they're talking about Asian sauce and whatever, yeah. like whatever you want. It's just gonna keep use it for kids, up. transits. You know, like they can start eating fish from chicken fingers or something. Like yeah. That. Oh, yeah. Make sure you go and check out some dogfish, guys. I mean, seriously, next time you catch a dogfish, eat it. Try it. Don't get don't be scared. Like we we were we were nervous before we took a bite of it, but now it. Jokes off. Jokes off. But thanks guys Good. for watching. Make sure you check out Thailand boats. The link's in the description. That's the boat we fished on today and it's an unbelievable vessel. If you're in Virginia and you want to catch Cobia, Vineo Sport Fishing, check them out. Link in the description, guys. Make sure to check out our new merch, our new camel shirts. They're really awesome. The link is also in the description. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.